Southwest environmental campaigners say plans to incinerate much of our rubbish in the future may prove to be a costly mistake. A number of energy from waste plants are to be built around the region, but campaigners say there could be better technologies. Our environment correspondent Adrian Campbell has been looking at one alternative. Could a collection of ripped up old rubbish dried out and graded for use as fuel be the answer to the growing problem of what to do with our waste? Now landfills running out, there's a move towards using rubbish to make heat and electricity. But at this demonstration plant in Swindon, they're showing off a technology which is different to incineration. It uses high temperatures to melt, gasify or vaporise waste, maximising what's recovered at the end. Until recently, waste management was all about throwing material into a big hole in the ground. And there's really been a paradigm shift in the, the whole way we see waste treatment. And we believe this is absolutely the solution to the, to the problem. An electrode is lowered into the plasma converter and gas and solid material fed into the chamber. The plasma arc in the middle of the device reaches around 6,000 degrees Celsius and the gas inside is around 1,000 degrees. Clean exhaust gases are produced which are then used to power generators. The rest of the material runs off and solidifies into what's called plasma rock. And the rock can be broken down and used in the construction industry. We were given a guided tour of the plant together with Peter Brooks, a southwest environmental campaigner. If this is a technology that actually gets maximum benefit out of all the use of materials and it gives you energy and it gives you a clean 1% plasma rock at the end which is completely environmentally acceptable. It's just the perfect solution. Now this is a demonstration facility. A, a full-scale plant could produce enough power for 15,000 homes. And when it comes to emissions, this plant is well within European Union limits. Norway and Belgium are about to build this type of facility, but our local authorities are slower to accept the concept. Working out the final costs of which system to buy isn't easy. But with landfill running out across the southwest, it's crucial that the planners back the right technology. Adrian Campbell, BBC Spotlight.